Family Guy Online was a cel-shaded browser-based MMORPG that went into open beta on April 17th, 2012. Say what? It was developed by Roadhouse Interactive and was published by 20th Century Fox. I know, just the name Family Guy Online sounds like a big joke to you, doesn't it? And if you heard of the show, I'm sure this is a game you might remember. Okay, I'm going to take a second and be serious here. No one expected Family Guy Online. Let's just get that right out of the way. The whole concept seemed ridiculous. I mean, there was potential there. I saw the commercial and it made it look good. And it was a fresh face to the world of online free-to-play gaming. So let's take it from the top. You boot that shit up, you get a pretty little intro, you know, that intro you know and love, and then you get to the character select screen, and holy shit! You get to play as the members of the family, that's fucking awesome! You could be Stewie, or Lois, or Peter... Chris and Meg came in a package, but let's be honest, who wanted to just be Meg? But unfortunately, Brian was locked, and that's a shame. So you click on, let's say, Lois, for example, and oh man, they, they did the old switcheroo on us. Lois was your class, so you don't get to be Lois. You get to be a generic looking background character that you create. There were a few options, nothing special, but don't worry, the Lois class isn't gender locked, so for example, you could be a boy Lois or a girl Stewie if you wanted. But, you know, we're all past that. I start the game, I'm outside of the Griffin's house, you know, I'm itching to see what the first quest is, what hilarity could ensue in this comedy show based game. Well, the first quest is to go into the house, talk to Chris, and help him find some stuff. Now here's a side note, the game looked good, and the house and town were detailed very nicely, it ran great even in browser, I mean I was skeptical that you didn't have to download it, but at one point 20th Century Fox planned for this game to run in Facebook, so whatever, I digress. But seriously, I gotta run around town to look for your shit Chris, and you ain't even coming with me man, you ain't gonna go outside and chill with the new homie? I mean, I caved in, I gave him the stuff, the logs and the rope and shit, and what am I rewarded with? A clip from the show! Oh sure, you get a little gold and a few points of XP, but the main thing is is that you get a 30 second clip of a show that you most likely seen already, because hey, the only reason you would be playing the Family Guy MMO is if you were a fan of the fucking show. And what do I get at the end of the clip? An advertisement showing where I can buy Family Guy episodes. So then I realized, yeah, this game isn't for me. And apparently it wasn't a game for anyone. Now don't get me wrong, there were nice sound bites. Would you like to come inside for a cupcake and a glass of wine? Little quips here and there. You could easily tell that there was satire all over this game. Noticeable attempts at humor, and I give them credit. But the game shut down January 18th of 2012, and it got shut down before it even came out of public beta. 20th Century never stated the reason, or if they did, I couldn't find it. But if I had to take a guess at what the reason was, it'd be because they realized they weren't going to make the money off this game that they thought they were. They knew they messed up, and they even offered a full refund on in-game purchases made up to 60 days prior of the cancellation announcement. This game was a flop if I ever seen one, man. A waste of a license and a good idea. And I think that even if the game did do well, the end result would have still have been a mediocre mess and considered a joke. The problem is, is that you could see the reason for this free game coming into existence. It was to get you to spend money. Everything was just wrong. It would have been better as a Facebook game, honestly. Which makes me feel bad for the people that put the time and the effort to create this Family Guy universe inside this shell of an MMO. So please join me in a moment of silence for all the hours lost developing this valiant effort at a trendy marketing scheme. <laughs> 